Hey guys, on today's video, we're going to be updating your iPad. So let's just go right into your settings. Under your settings, you're going to see a bunch of options. And the very first one will be your name or your device name. So just go right into there. And then using iCloud, make that backup. If you guys have no more space on your iCloud, just hook it up to your computer and use iTunes in order to make the backup. And if you're having any problems, you can also use iTunes in order to update it. For Mac users, you can always use Finder. Anyways, once you're in here, just go right into General. Under General, your second option will be Software Update. Under Software Update, we should see this spinning around and then we should see Download and Install. Some of you may just see Install at this point in time and that's because you already downloaded the update but you still need to install it yourself. This update's only 131 megabytes so it's really small. So for most of you, it's only gonna be about 10 minutes. Anyways, let's just tap on Download and Install. It's gonna ask you for a passcode if you have one. Once you have put in your passcode, it's gonna start downloading. During the download process, it doesn't really matter if it turns off or anything goes wrong because you can always download it again. However, during the installation process, it's very important that your iPad does not turn off. That means we need at least 50% of your battery. And even if you do have 50% of your battery, I highly suggest hooking up some electricity just to make sure it doesn't turn off when it's installing the actual update. Once again, the speed of this update really depends on your Wi-Fi and which iPad you guys have. Older iPads take a little bit longer. Plus, if you guys have slower internet, it might take a little bit longer. So maximum, I would say 20 minutes in total. However, like I mentioned before, it should be no more than 10 minutes for most of you, the whole process, downloading plus installing. Once it has downloaded, we're gonna see install now. Once we hit on install now, it's gonna verify and then we're gonna see an Apple logo and a loading bar. So right now we're just gonna tap on install now. It's gonna verify the update and then it's just gonna restart. After it starts, we're gonna see an Apple logo in the loading bar like I mentioned, which looks exactly like this. It's gonna load up two times. Second time is gonna be a lot faster, and then we're done. So around this time, it's gonna be maximum around 20 minutes. And it's gonna ask you for a passcode if you have one. And there we go, that would be it for this update. Anyways, if you guys have any questions, comments, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.